and we're back. So I've returned to London from our previous ex escapade in Nuncio, and I went ahead and did the visit with the family and told the uh, child a sea story, and now this event has triggered. I want to go away to sea. Your child wants to sign on with a ship already, but time passes quickly and more quickly and most quickly on the Unterzee. How many years have you been at Z? Don't ask. Time operates slightly out of the dark. We'll go ahead and permit it. A family tradition if your child survives. Many Zaylers don't. You of all people know that. All is well for now. New Year's Day, 189. Quartermaster's assistant of legal age signed on recommendation of legal guardian. Give equal treatment. You have a scion. When you die, the next generation may take up the torch. In the meantime, they will still live at home, probably. We'll go ahead and rest, see what that does. It's expensive, but we did lose 15 terror, and we now have two restful nights. Your will to, you, you will rise to the sun and be lost. Menaces, yearning, burning. Oh, Lord. Also turned in my port reports. Still need to deliver the clay men. There we go. Let's keep hiring on some crew. What are we at? 21? Okay. Ship's pretty dinged up, so we'll go to dry dock. Get a full repair. And now I think it's time to go ahead and try to visit the eye. We'll go ahead and buy some candles for the next time that we want to go... Uh, to the island with the monks. But for now, I want to go and explore that eye, which was over here. See if there's anything underwater at this sea wreck. No, not really. God, being underwater is terrifying. 
especially with that sonar pulse. <laughs> I figured I would stop by these places on the way there to get some intelligence and stuff. As fast and round and wild as the moon. We've already seen this, so let's dive into the pupil. Dive and exult. You descend. The blackness of the pupil expands. There is no cornea to bar your way, no lens. The pupil is a tunnel, and your vessel plunges into it. Your forward light dies. Your lamps die. Darkness unfurls like spilled ink. A cool breeze brushes your face. Under sunless skies, you are in a room of sorts. It is bulbous in shape, not unlike a kidney. The furnishings, if that's what they are, look like the work of a surrealist. This straight-backed, many-legged edifice is perhaps a chair, that oily surface a table? An altar? The breeze, winter cold, enters through an arced window. Through it, you can see a dark sky. The sun is black. It squirms. What's that? A sound from behind you. Something moves in the chamber. The lumpen mass opposite the window is not, after all, a disastrous attempt at a coat stand. It is a living thing, wrapped in multitudinous layers of gauze. The creature is towering, bulky, and unevenly shaped beneath its fluttering veils. It carries what looks like a measuring rod, notched with unfamiliar enumerations. Its voice is shrill. Welcome, trespasser, to the house of rods and chains. Your daring is notable and rare. My employer... Here, the thing extends what is hopefully an arm towards the window, and the sable, seething sun. We'd like you to deliver a message to the neath. You will be compensated. It shuffles towards the table altar. A set of iridescent scales stand there, the balls perfectly balanced. One ball has a bubble of glass in which something bright and misty coils. The other ball is empty. Your behold quality is now exclamation mark. You are seen. Sure, let's agree to carry the message. Is it curiosity, greed, madness? In days to come, you will wonder what drove you to accept. Please, the creature squeals, inclining its upper portions towards the scales. You take the glass bubble. The wisp inside it peers madly out with pinprick eyes. The black sun is closer now, glaring into the chamber like a child through a dollhouse window. Pain blooms behind your left temple. It migrates across your cheek, down your neck, over your shoulder. You clutch at it and feel a sliding, swelling pucker on your skin before it moves out of reach. The liberation of night began long ago, the veiled creature pipes. Tell whoever you choose, or do not. You are the message. Those who must know, will know. It bangs its measuring rod on the floor. The sun screams in joy. Everything goes dark. You find yourself back in your submarine, your crew desperately steering it away from the vast eye on the Z bed. Your pain is easing, but not gone. You stumble wildly to your quarters. A mirror. You need a mirror. We now have one judgment's egg. Is this a soul? It's pale and bright. Souls like this, they say, are the spores of strange gods. We have one additional eye of an unob on an unobtrusive part of our person, so we have an extra eyeball now. It is fortunately sleeping. We now have one supremacy, the anarchists. Lo, thy dread empire, chaos is restored, light dies before thy uncreating world, and our behold quality has gone. Let's get the hell out of here.
Uh, I really don't feel like doing this storyline right now. It's a really good story to have, actually. It's great. There, You can get a great reward at the end of it. But it's very lengthy, and I just don't feel like reading all of it right now. Light's fever, the delirium of sunlight grows stronger in you. The dream recurs again and again, a great light and an ending, a kind of consummation. What do you yearn for? Shining towers, somewhere ice and riddle worked rock rises towards the false stars. Close your eyes and see them, behind the ice is light. Behind the light are colors. Behind the colors, darkness. Behind the colors, a name. Burning, burning. We've gained fragment and terror and lost a tale of terror. I suspect that that might be talking about, uh, that vision might be talking about Frostfound, since that was that sort of icy, uh, towering spire. Hmm. Go ahead and pass on that thing for now. So it looks like our Hunter Z stuff has actually um, given us a lot of new stories, but I'm still not quite ready to do that one. I don't know what it is or anything, but I'm just not quite ready. So even when I try to seek another opportunity, my spies keep wanting the same stuff. I think I'm going to leave off here and give this a try tomorrow since it's getting pretty late.